Hey dolls, welcome to my video. It's Emily Nadia Sasha. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a review of the violets by Julius. Um, this is a Julius Place palette. It's a little mini. And I just want to give you guys a quick review on it. They had a sale at Ulta and I wanted to check out this palette. So I went ahead and ordered it. If you're interested in watching a review as well as swatches, keep on watching and you're definitely going to get your swatches and a review. I love you dolls. Be sure to like and subscribe and stay tuned. Let's get this video to 10 likes. Also, if you like my glitter eyeliner, I have my own makeup company. It's called Nadia Sasha Beauty. So be sure to order. If you're interested in PR with me, then go ahead and send me an email and I will get back to you. Hey dolls, how are you doing? So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I get my eyeshadow look with the Violets palette from Juvia's Place. I'll do a few swatches for you guys. So I'm just gonna do the top three rows. I'm gonna swatch them on my arm. I'm just gonna get all my fingers and dig them in at once. This is the fingers. Let me just swatch them on my arm. That's the purple. Well, these are the swatches. The purple swatched the best in the middle because I think I got more powder on that one. Um, and that is those swatches. Now let me do the bottom three and we shall see. So for these, they didn't swatch too well. These are all the swatches. And we're gonna see the dark purple is a little bit patchy. So I'm gonna try to use it, try to give it a chance and see how I could work with it. I'm gonna use the BH Studio Pro. Love this concealer. The only thing about it is that it dries pretty fast but it works pretty well. I'm using this concealer to prime my eyes. My eyes are officially primed. The first shade that I'm gonna be using today is going to be this purple shade. I put concealer on the bottom of my eyes so that when I go in and I put eyeshadow on the bottom, it automatically sticks. I'm using my BH Cosmetics brush in the number six and I'm gonna be applying this purple shade. This is going to be our transition shade. I'm just gonna blend the edges of this purple. This is the difference between blended and unblended. Go in with the darkest purple shade right here, and we're gonna be applying that on the end of the eyelid. I'm gonna be using the JH40 brush from the Jaclyn Hill collection in collaboration with Morphe. And I'm just gonna add this to the outer. I'm just gonna add this to the outer corner in a V shape. Keeping it very close into that line on the outer eyelid. So I'm letting the brush just fall into the eyelid. Come back, come back. I'm just focusing on the outer eyelid, stacking up the purple color. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take this on the lid and I'm just going to keep it within my crease just above my crease and I don't really want to take this purple too high it's going to be blending it on the ends and making sure that it blends into the lighter purple we have the purple built up so what I'm going to do is get concealer and cut my crease and I'm going to do a half cut crease on my eyelid I'm going to use a nail brush top of the concealer for those of you that don't know I have my own brand and I made Nadia Sasha Beauty and these are my glitters so I'm gonna be applying a glitter line on top of this cut crease right here purple shade that we used at the top we are going to use on the bottom 
I'm applying it very closely to the waterline. Be applying some YSL mascara. This is Mega Volume Faux Kliss. Kliss? Kliss? I, I, I don't know how to pronounce that, but that is a mascara we're using. Some eyeshadow got in my eye and turned it red. If that counts as part of the review, you should know that. And I'll be right back with my falsies on. Hey dolls, so I completely finished my eyeshadow look. This is using the Juvia's Place, the Violets by Juvia's Place. Um, overall thoughts that I have about this palette is uh, that the colors are a little patchy, especially this dark purple shade right here. But overall, I really do enjoy this palette. I think it's really a nice palette if you're into more muted purples, um, pastel purples. They're very, it's a very beautiful palette. I do suggest that you guys use it. If you are interested in purchasing my glitter liners, my website is going to be down below in the description box. Also, if you like the beat, be sure to check out the Instagram in the link below for the beat. Alright, I love you guys. I enjoy making this video so much for you guys. Um, if you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. I love you dolls and I'll see you later. Thank you.